welcome to my youtube channel powerpoint university in this tutorial i'm going to show you how to make a table of contents in powerpoint or you can use for some other purpose like in this example i'm going to show you the business startup steps and you can see here there's a vertical bar and the first step is written select a name and a legal structure when i click it goes to step two write a business plan and if you can see the previous steps are getting a tick mark that means we have completed those steps so likewise i have just put all the steps like seven eight and till ninth so let's see how we can create this table of content slide in powerpoint add a new slide go to insert shapes and select rounded corner rectangle draw the rectangle make it fully curved and reduce the size so it should look like a vertical bar make it no outline and give a different color in this case i'm going to use gray select the bar press ctrl d to duplicate it and give some different color and place this green color bar exactly on top of the gray bar and then reduce the size of the green bar i'm going to add the the number and the text so this is the heading number 1 i'll just type 1 and increase the font size and change the font size to whatever you like i'm going to use uh, arial nova make it bold and place exactly at the center then add the the text so here i'm just saying going to say that at headline 1 you can replace your own text there now go to the slide right mouse click and say duplicate slide and increase the size of the green bar and copy the text and the number press ctrl d and place it here change the number to two and the headline also to number two and this headline i'm just going to change the color to gray and reduce the size a little bit and here the number i'm going to change the font to something called webdings and just type a remove the font and type a a means a tick mark go to transition and select morph and make the duration to 1.75 or make it 1 now if you see here headline 1 when i click it becomes headline 2 so headline 1 i'm just going to change the the font size reduce the size right mouse click and make it a duplicate slide again increase the bar size make add this one press ctrl d to duplicate make this as a three so here this one i'm just going to type a small letter a and make it webdings so it becomes a, a tick mark so just copy the format to the headline two and this is three So let's see one more time this is headline one the headline two and then it shows the headline three i'm going to increase the to decrease the duration instead of 1.75 let's make it one and add one more so this time i'm going to add four
you can add as many as you want i'm just going to in this tutorial i'm just going to show four only again change the font to webdings this is a headline 4 so let's play again headline 1 headline 2 3 and 4 If you want, you can add more, five, six, seven. That's it from me, friends. Thank you for watching my YouTube channel. And don't forget to subscribe to PowerPoint University. See you soon with more interesting stuff. Till then, goodbye.